From what we can see in Federico Caballero's life, he truly is committed to reaching excellence in a manner that would preserve his people's ethics. He is compassionate towards his people's work through means of keeping their oral literature alive and a socially committed person for diligently documenting 10 Panay Bukidnon epics in Kinaraya language that led him to be a recipient of the Gamaba Award. Despite the backlash he had received and the unwillingness of the people around him to learn new skills, he still managed to preserve his culture's folk art in the Batnay Bukidnon epics, which is the pride and beauty of the oral tradition of his heritage. He opened the eyes of many people, leading them to rediscover their pride in their heritage and being no longer ashamed of their roots as to where they came from. He teaches us the value of cultural stewardship in preserving the legacy of indigenous communities through his artistic endeavors and commitment to maintaining Kinaraya culture. Future generations will be able to access and appreciate the oral literature, customs, and folk art of the Kinaraya people because of his unwavering dedication to excellence and compassion for them. We can all praise everything that Federico Caballero did but without raising awareness like what he did when his oral tradition or his heritage was in the process of being extinct, there truly is no point in celebrating as it would only continue to be a cycle of forgetting the learned knowledge that we have today. So you, our viewer, must raise awareness and speak up for you may become the thread that links each and every one of our stories together.